Hello, I'm Karen Joseph with Seven Networking. Thank you for joining me this evening. I am so happy to be here with you. Hello, Hillary. How are you? It's getting late where you are, but thank you for joining. I'm going to talk in a little bit about what every entrepreneur needs to know to be successful, right? Don't you all want to be successful? Send me some hearts if you want to be successful because I know you do if you're an entrepreneur. That's what we're all striving for. Hi, Brian. Nicholas, hello, hello. Tell me um, if you're an entrepreneur. Hearts. Hello, how are you? Sometimes they're um they're hard. Oh, ASU in Vegas. I live in Arizona now and um Um, thank you for joining me. I am Karen. Working organization. Um, we're coming up on our six year anniversary. Hello, Altiza. Nice to meet you. And I can't wait to meet you actually physically in person. She's an artist. She does beautiful artwork. Fabulous. Well, my daughter is a senior in high school. She goes to Hamilton High School. We live in Chandler. So she's got one more year and um, then she goes goes away. She's moving out. <laughs> she's like, I'm too old to be living at home next year and I'm too young to live on my own. So I'm going to live in those dorms. So even though she'll be 20 minutes away, she'll be away. So that will be nice. Oh, he's starting his sophomore year. Great. Does he live in the dorms? Hi, Shelly. How are you? Happy anniversary. Thank you for those hearts. Thank you, thank you. Hi, Jam. I want her to live in the dorms. <laughs> um, hi, JK. Thank you for joining us. I'm Karen Joseph with Seven Networking. We are a networking organization for entrepreneurs, and I'm going to talk about things tonight that every successful entrepreneur needs to do to be successful in their business yes it is great for them to leave home um, because you know they've been with us for a long time so it's time for them to go out on their own um, feel free to invite friends to this scope you know to share it with people that you know are entrepreneurs or people who just like to meet other people because that's how I started my my business of seven networking I moved to Chandler, Arizona. Hi, Lucky Cupcake Company. Thank you for joining us. Oh, do you make delicious cupcakes? Yum, yum. What's your favorite kind? And tell me your name, please. Um, if you are an entrepreneur, yes. Tell me what you do, please, because I about what entrepreneurs need to be successful dreams and sometimes you know there's rocky road ahead right things happen you can't always follow those um those you will get there um you know i've just focus, focus, focus. Set time aside in the day. Hi, I am Samson. Set time aside in the day to do your important tasks. I have to admit, I have a little confession. I am addicted to Periscope. Hi, hi. I am addicted to Periscope. It's my new... I am scoping night and day and watching other... What do I do? I connect with new people and build. That this is all good. Hi, MP2400. Tell me your name and where you're from and if you have a business. 
We're talking about what every successful entrepreneur needs to do. One of them is stay focused. that I really don't want to do. Yes, it is a huge addiction. I totally agree, Leanne. Yeah. Yep. Tasks done super early in the day because I want to get them just done over with and then I can move on and business owner soon after college. Wow, that is really cool. Where do you go to school? Tell us where you go to school. We'd like to know. So another thing I've learned, Steve Mays, thank you for joining in. Um, being an entrepreneur for six years, in my past I was a teacher. Hi. And um, I love entrepreneur because I love helping others. I love supporting others. And I love teaching others. And that's what I get to do in my business because, oh, you Florida, fabulous. I hope you get to go to the beach a lot. Um, I get to help others. I get to teach others. And that's really what, you know, I did for many years before I was a mom and now an entrepreneur. So uh, what I have learned, though, is you have to delegate. As much as we want to take control over things in our business and we exactly the way we want them done. Hi, Steve Mays. Um, I'm, I own a business networking organization called Seven. Nice to meet you, Steve. So, but I've learned you have to delegate. And I know, you know what? I tried blocking trolls last night and my, um, my, cause I have an Android. It just froze up. Whatever. Um, I'm just going to ignore, ignore him because I can't believe there's people out there that have nothing better to do with their time than to, Hey, hey, you're addicted to Periscope too, Steve? Yeah. I'm scoping two times a day now. I started out as a once a day scoper and twice a day. So, all right, the Green Up Girl, tell us, do you have a business? Who do you follow? Oh, I follow lots of people. I follow all. I follow uh, Robert Stern, who's back east. I follow lots of people just um, to get to know people. And where do you entrepreneur? I find people to delegate to right being part of a group or part of an organization because I have found um, virtual assistants some help me with sending out a Monday morning newsletter that I send out to all my members to let them know what's happening at 7. I get some help with some social media because I'm not really that tech savvy and um, I also get some website help which is nice too. So also my children have helped me as well. Um, my son is 12 and over the summer I gave him some work to do because he wanted a new phone and I said, you know what, if you want a new phone, you're going to have to work for mama this summer. So he did some work for me as well. Thank you for those hearts because I love, love, love hearts. You can keep them coming. Another thing is, um, no, 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 Seven is a business networking organization, Leanne. It stands for, great question, super question. It stands for supporting and empowering the vision of entrepreneurial networking. And um, I started the group out here in Arizona six years ago. We have about 13 chapters in Arizona. Yes, good to teach kids responsibility. And um, I also, we have three chapters in, in uh, Vegas now. In a couple of weeks, I'm going to go visit with the members out there. So um, I love to keep journals. I just write things, write things, write things, write things in um, in notebooks so I can keep things straight. I'm more of an old-fashioned um, paper and pencil kind of gal. 
And yes, we'll de we're definitely going to meet. You're going to have to message me your number. Um, so you know what? Um, so I write things down in journals. Um, and it helps me to keep my ideas flowing. It helps me to get some good notes. And then I can go back.